I started sailing uh, uh, following my grandfather and his uh, old six meter. But uh, my first boat was a penguin. We lived uh, far from the sea because my father was in the army. Uh, we moved to Brasilia and then I started sailing snipes over there. And uh, it was pretty strong class uh, uh, at the lake there and uh, pretty good, uh, strong fleet. So I learned a lot there. And of course, uh, my uncles have a, a big tradition on the class with three world championships. And uh, that uh, also uh, helped us and, and they, they always uh, telling us uh, things that they tried that was good, things uh, shouldn't try because they tried it wasn't good. So uh, a lot of experience uh, they had there and that uh, helped us a lot to, to grow in the class. And uh, it's, it's still a pretty strong class in Brazil, which is uh, quite fun. I started sailing uh, in Brasilia with my older brother. Uh, but uh, we, we are very different. Uh, and uh, we didn't, we don't match very well. Uh, he's a very nice guy, but uh, very difficult for me to go sailing with. So it didn't last very long. And then uh, I started sailing with a, a guy that uh, used to live in Brasilia, now lives here in, in the States, uh, which is uh, Eduardo Mascarenhas. And we won a Junior Worlds together in San Diego. Uh, and then uh, after I moved back to Rio, I started to sail with Lars. And, uh, and that worked very well. We, we are very similar, the way we behave on the boat and uh, the way we think, and uh, yeah, we have a very good uh, chemistry together. You know? So uh, it was wonderful sailing with Lars, but we were just getting too big. And then uh, when we won the world championship in, uh, in, 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 uh, in Portugal, we were already uh, weighing way too much for a snipe. We were 165 kilos, so it was quite hard on the on the medium wind there to, to survive. And after that, I sailed with Marcelo Maia, which is, uh, is, is my last uh, crew on the snipe. And uh, we won the world championship in 87. And uh, he had a better physique for, for, for me because he was uh, uh, lighter and smaller. I think snipe uh, has a lot of uh, good things. Uh, it's a very technical boat, very technique. and. Uh, for, for sailing, uh, for, for, for tuning, and uh, so I think you can get a, a very old boat and uh, still be competitive, so uh, you can have a relatively cheap campaign. Uh, I won the, my first uh, world championship with, uh, with Lars, with a wooden boat, I was uh, my, my same age, uh, so uh, that's pretty nice, I think. You know, the, all the boats last very long. and. Uh, and uh, there's very different techniques you can use and still be very close in speed. The speeds of the boats are, are very similar, so it makes for a very tactical race, which I think is very fun.